the gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. My dear brothers and sisters, we are now on the third week of Lent. And today we heard in the first reading the cleansing or the curing of Naaman the leper. While our gospel reading today also made mention about this. And that is the cleansing of Naaman, the Syrian. The mentioning of the cleansing of the leper Naaman would also bring us the very significance of the Lenten season, in which the Lenten season is a time of cleansing and a time of purification. May these days be an opportunity for us to be cleansed, to be cleaned, to be purified. And may our thoughts and desires be cleansed and purified so that our thoughts, our desires may be holy in that of God's ways and God's thoughts and God's words. My dear brothers and sisters, our Lord Jesus Christ once again has led us to see our own relationships with one another. In the gospel today, Jesus felt rejected. That is why he said, no prophet is accepted in his own native place. Jesus was disheartened because he knew all he thought that his native fellow men or town mates would be proud of him. But it was, it was not. Rather, Jesus was being rejected by his own town mates. That's why Jesus also did not spend most of his time to his town mates and to a place, his own native place, in which he has not been given a chance to, to prove his words. And that is why he moved to another place in Capernaum. I think this is very uh, natural uh, reaction if we are not uh, appreciated, if we are not regarded. So why don't we spend wasting our time and energy to people or to place in which our talents and skills will be wasted? That's why in our gospel reading today, our Lord Jesus Christ would give us a lesson that let us not waste our time and energy 